All right, guys. Uh, we all knew this would happen sooner or later. Um, I, I can't say that I'm surprised, but I didn't really think it would be this soon. Greg is moving out of the house. Um, but the goal is, is to stay close to the house. Yeah, I want to be close. I don't want to move too far away. Okay, so mom went inside to go get ready and I'm going to go feed the animals and then we're going to take y'all guys to go find a place for me to live. Oh, this is a cabin. Double loft, 12 by 32. What was the other one? 12 by 28. So this this doesn't look any bigger than the other one, does it? it might be because of the windows. That's right. This does not have windows. Except for the two front ones. Did the other? So the other one had windows. Yeah, it had a window here, back there, back here. So that's the difference. Yeah. Mental note: get windows. Yes. So this has windows. Open it. It's smaller. Here's a two loss. This is smaller, yeah. Smaller than That's a 12 by 28. We're locked in. So much for leaving the door open. But Well, about 28. I wonder what that other one was that we just came from. It was big. Yeah. It was a, I don't know. 16 by 30. But this 40s. is, yeah, this is a little bit bigger than what I had envisioned. So, how big is your bedroom? Uh, four, 12 by 14 or 14 by 12. 12 by 14. You think it was 12 by 14? Yeah, 12 by 14. 12 by 14? Uh, so we want somewhere in that area, you know, the same square footage, a little bit bigger, because you're gonna have a bathroom, kitchen, a little bit bigger, but not much bigger than your than your bedroom that you're currently in. Of course, we want lofts, I think. Yeah. Maybe we'll look at the others. These windows are smaller. But it does have the, the two. Um, yeah. What, I wonder why this one doesn't have anything to tell how big it is. I can tell by looking at it, it's too big, right? So, but we're getting a good idea. Because 
because of what? No window, no windows, and they're and they're tiny, with no loft. Yeah. Just I, that's a preventive. That's not a loft. That's what you catch that door. Don't let that door hit. The wind's blowing all bad. So but this has two windows up front and two small windows. Okay, the thing about these, these are big. I didn't see any, um, they were mostly big. Were there any smaller ones? No, they were like all by 12 by something. Well, yeah, but 12 by, 12's not the problem, it's the Link. 36. The so 32, 30, 28, that was the lowest, was 12 by okay. 28. But they can, um, these these the, these here are not the only ones. Like no. they can, first of all, they can customize them. They can build one to suit your needs, your the size you need and everything. But um, just because that's all that's on this lot, this doesn't mean that that's all that this company has. So what size is this? Uh, 10 by 24. 10 by 24. This is what we were looking at. What was 10 by 16? Uh, 10 by 20. 10 by 20. And this is a 10 by 24. Two lofts. Ooh, look how big that is. I didn't realize yeah. how big that was. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize that that part was green. <laughs> Quite a bit bigger than your bedroom, isn't it? Yeah, like probably about maybe here. Okay. Do you have your phone? You use your calculator. Hundred sixty-eight, and this is two forty. Two forty. Oh, okay. Plus the loss. The loss gives you. Can you put this up there? The loss gives you more room. These are these are pretty good size windows too. Yeah. Oh wow. Little stand right here. I think at the glass door because the wind's blowing. This is way too big, but this is just kind of an idea of what they look like, sort of, uh, minus the mess. Be sure you get a hold of it. Hurry up, gotta get the glass. That wind is insane. Is it? Oh. So this is a good, well, there's no paperwork. This is a good size. It's got two lofts. this is a big one. Yeah, well, isn't this similar to the one we just looked at? Uh, I think the one we looked at was probably about here. So you think so? That much more big. I thought they were about the same. But it is kind of, it is big. Yeah. It's really big. It's got small windows on it. Nope. This is bigger. A lot bigger. What they got going on here? I think this That's thing. interesting, huh? Yeah. That's it. Small windows. Ooh, there's a window up there on this loft. There, on the other one too. there was? I didn't, yeah. I didn't notice it on the other one. This is too big. We're looking for something small for you because I don't know how long you're going to live in it. And once you leave it, because I'm buying it, once you leave it, what you would, you know, like what, what would this, what purpose would this serve for me? Yeah, you can get it up. It's 
big old hole, tiny, big tiny hole. Now if it was wider, I'd put a pool table in it. <laughs> Need, isn't it? No windows, no locked. Oh, one window, my bad. And barely a loft. That's not a loft. <laughs> That's barely anything. That's not a loft. So, but, and you know, width and length, that's about right, isn't it? Huh? That's small. Yeah, but that's, that's what we're looking for. This right here is bigger than your bedroom. This one's too big. But one we just came out of is pretty close. Okay. Yeah, we could use that. Found you one. Okay, I don't understand. Well, what's wrong with this one? It's too small. A while ago, you said you were claustrophobic. Oh, with this, I would have been. Get in. Get in. Lay down. Lay down. See if you can lay down in there. I mean, you know, take a little night. I think it's just fine. There's not one on the side there. There's not a window on the side, just the one on the front. Yep. Right size. Good night.
So when we started the video, you probably didn't think that we were gonna get a tiny home, put it in the backyard for Greg to move into, but we did. And uh, I'm gonna, I haven't been, since they set it up, I haven't been in here, so I'm gonna take you in to look at it. I hope he doesn't mind me filming at his house. No, he doesn't mind. <laughs> well, hello. <laughs> so, this is a uh, this is Greg's new new place. You want to uh, give us a tour? Tell sure. us about it. So it is a ten by ten feet long. No, ten feet wide by twenty four feet long. I don't know how tall it is, but there is a loft over the porch and then a loft at the back for like a bedroom. So, let me get up here. Here, show that up there. I can't reach it. Okay. Um, my plan for this is to extend it two feet to four feet more out so that it has a bigger bedroom because this is like four feet. And I would, of course, I'd have a railing, but that's small for me. It's too small for me. You can't fit up there? I could probably fit up there, but that would be a small bedroom up there. Well, what? This is your bedroom. Well, if this is my bedroom, then where's my living room? Right here. Where's my dining room? Right here. Because uh, my kitchen and my bathroom. Or bathroom and kitchen so if i did the bathroom and kitchen back here it'd be probably right here would be my bathroom to the back wall and then my kitchen that way that's a big bathroom that would make the shower a sink and a toilet or shower sink and toilet yeah the shower would probably be on the back wall back there but yeah it will have it will have a um the the plan is that it will have a bathroom hooked up to my septic and electricity hooked up to my electricity. And who has to pay to get that done? Me. Yep. Greg. So yeah, Greg, um, let's see if I can fix the camera. No, it's just my face. Okay. So, <laughs> so Greg, I'm paying for the shed and Greg is paying to make it Ready right, to live in. To make it livable. So either I pay someone to come out and do the electric and plumbing, or I am taught how to do it and do it myself. You're going to pay someone to come do it. <laughs> okay, yeah. So he's going to pay to make it livable. Um, you know, whatever that is to him. How, however much he wants done, he'll, he'll be the one to... Uh, He'll be the one to pay for that. He's gonna hook into my septic, my electric, but it's gonna be done right. That's gonna get expensive. Yeah. Uh, so he's got plans for the, the, the kitchen. What kind of kitchen? Talk about the kitchen for a second. Let me turn the camera around. So I'm not gonna have a big refrigerator. It's gonna be like a little miniature fridge. So less, I'll probably have the mini fridge here, and of course counter space, then a microwave. I'm not going to have a stove, I'll have my sink and then just more counter space. You've gone and into the bathroom with your counter space. You're in the shower with counter space. Get out of the bathroom. <laughs> I'm going to have some counter space, probably right here then. Some more counter space and then the kit, uh, microwave, mini fridge, sink, and then just cam uh, cabinets below and up top. So it's just like the corner, does the your kitchen be this corner? Yeah, this corner will yeah. probably be the kitchen. So it'd be underneath the either storage or bedroom. I'm gonna point out, um, Greg will still be, um, let's see, eating a lot of meals with me. He won't be cooking out here. Um, he'll be eating eating meals with me. Uh, unless it's something I bought at the well, yeah. store. Well, yeah. Unless he unless he microwaves it. But what I'm saying is this. He's not, he's not moving out and not having a stove and 
not having a way to feed himself other than to eat out. He will, he will be eating meals with me. Um, he will not be paying an electric bill or um, water, bill. water bill or anything like that um, at this point anyway. So, uh, I mean, I, I don't know how long this is gonna, I don't know how long this will last for him. Right now, I think it is a good transition for the both of us. It will get me used to <clears throat> being alone and not feeling like I have to keep an eye on him as much. And it will give him a little bit more independence, right? Yeah. And uh, are you excited? Yeah. It's about time, huh? Mm -hmm. But I did my part. The shed's here. It's on Greg now. Okay, Greg, you got anything else that you want to tell them before we go? Just wanted to point out that I have one, two, three windows, and which is good in case I can't get out of the door for some reason. They have been enough for me to get through. And there's one more thing. Let's go to check out the porch. Oh, yeah. One day I'm going to have a porch. You wait. You watch and see. I'll have a porch. Oh, it's cold out here. Yeah. In case somebody breaks in and steals your stuff. <laughs> yeah. So, I have a four foot by ten foot porch. Yeah. Let's get ten foot wide by four foot long. Well, let me get it over here and see. Going over there, just so they can get an idea. So it, gets, it goes the whole length. So that's why it's ten foot. So. It's really 20, 20 feet inside and four foot out here. Which I'm, I think this is gonna be stained or painted the same. Uh, yeah, you need to do something with some it. Some type of color closer to this. You need a little little chair out here. Yeah. You gonna um, drink your coffee out here? Probably. That's something else you need in there is your coffee pot. Yeah, I need to put my coffee pot out there. I'll probably wash Tara run around like I have a perfect view oh that's her backyard where her backyard is yeah dang it's cold so I have a lot of decisions to make like color of paint what type of flooring so watch future videos to see how my tiny house comes out